you can use your webcam in Zoom without OBS. But the problem with connecting your webcam directly to Zoom as a source is you don't have access to all of your webcam settings. That means your webcam quality is going to suffer as a result. And the settings that Zoom does make available to you really aren't that good. So I'm going to teach you how to add OBS as a camera source in Zoom to help you get the best image quality possible for your Zoom meetings. To do this, you'll need a plugin called OBS Virtual Cam and it's right from the OBS Project website. I'll go ahead and link it in the description. So click download and download it to wherever you want and open. It might ask for administrative privileges. Now we'll set it up. And by default, it just installs it where the OBS Studio is located on your computer install one and then finish all right now you're gonna have to restart obs so let me go ahead and do that now in the main obs window go up to tools and then virtual cam there are a few other settings you can change here like horizontal flip at the moment this is kind of buggy so i wouldn't mess with this buffered frames i move this to zero this like adds extra delay to your webcam so i just drag buffer frame to zero and then start so at this point, you're actually gonna have to quit Zoom. Don't just press the X on the upper right because it actually stays open. Right click it on the taskbar and then quit Zoom. Now reopen it. Click settings on the upper right, the video. And now you should see OBS camera here. If you didn't actually go to quit Zoom, then it might not show up. OBS camera. And now this is my feed from OBS. All right, so now in Zoom, all these automatic settings, let's turn all these off, turn off mirror my video, turn off touch up my appearance. And now we can edit all of our webcam settings directly in OBS. So let's do that to get this image looking good. Now I already have a full guide on the best OBS webcam settings linked in the info card and the description. But really quick, let me just show you. Right click your webcam, properties, configure video. I can change the white balance. I can change the exposure. Make sure the gain's at zero. It looks pretty good, but let me make it a little bit more vibrant. So I'll apply these and then right click the webcam again, filters, and I have a LUT that I've applied and I have a video that goes into how to apply LUTs in the info card and in the description. So I'll apply this LUT. And now I have a way better looking and more vibrant image that I simply couldn't get by using the webcam as a source directly in Zoom. See you in the next video.